it back off a little bit. Making it less now. Be careful the ball hides on by. What's going on guys? Welcome back to my channel. It's Conservancy here. Today I'm gonna have another sort of like an update to what um my video back in the day was. I think it was like September 28th or something like that. I posted a guide on the sounds and stuff that I use for my 5M. So I decided since I upgraded my PC, you guys would have started seeing the first part in yesterday's video or later this week's video. Earlier this week's video, sorry. Um you saw that I put together the new system. I had to redownload 5M, I had to redownload GTA and completely do everything from the beginning. So, with that being said, um, I decided that I was going to do a video of me putting in all of my stuff over again. So, that would be my mods, my audio and everything. I'm changing up a couple of things, so we'll hop in it. Remember, if you like this video, drop a like, comment, subscribe, turn on bell notifications so you know if I post and I'll continue to do videos like these. So before further ado, let's hop into the guide, y'all. Alright, so just we can just go through a couple of the stuff that I use. I'm gonna use this one, I'm gonna try this one. Usually I was using the 4.0 version, but um this is current, this has 5M support, so I wanna kinda listen to how it sounds. But we're gonna download this. I'll have a link to this down in the description down below. Remember to go ahead and support the creator who made these mods. Next one, I'm gonna go back and use Turbo Sounds by Hippie. These were good. I really like them, so I'm gonna just continue using them. Next one, the Dodge Door Chime. I'm changing up my door chime. I had the Ford one before. Now I'm gonna put in the Dodge Door Chime. So I'll have this link as well. Next one will be Ford Indicator Sound. I'm gonna have this in as well. So yeah, and I really like the Wheeling Sapphire. Sorry, Wheeling Sencom Sapphire. Um, but I'm gonna be using a um a Rumbler Tone. I this might not be the actual file here um but i can't find the one that i have so i'll just link this one here and you guys can either go and see if you can find it on your own but this is these are the mods we're gonna be installing today for our sounds so next video is probably gonna be my visuals i'll probably do that next week or week after i uh, use nve it's pretty simple to install but i guess some people might need to know or need to see it so we're gonna get into the actual setup process a couple other things you guys are going to need um, is going to be open IV and archive face, which is up here. Um, I currently um, currently I do not have. Well, I'll, I'll find a link for archive face for you guys to use. It's free to use so you can easily download it. So I will just find a link for you or the link that I found it at. And I'm also going to drop a link to open IV. If you have been modding and you know, open IV is integral for these things. So first we're gonna start with the siren so i'm gonna go here and go into my mods i put all my mods in one folder just so it's easier so what i'm gonna do now is that i'm gonna go to x64 audio sound effects and then we're gonna replace the resonant rp uh f file and the weapons player file right here and that's gonna be just the siren we're gonna go back here now i'm gonna go into the resident or rpf file we're gonna see uh vehicles dot awc and i'm gonna do export to open format what i'm gonna do now is that i'm gonna try to find um i'll replace this one this one is on my mass storage drive so i'll just replace this actually no i did i changed my mind i'm gonna put this on my desktop just so it's easier so let's do that and that is to unpack uh this one so that i can easily edit so we'll jump to that part now all right y'all now we are on our desktop we're gonna go to vehicles and open this up you'll see all of the audio files in here those are all the audio files so now we're gonna go and start editing certain stuff so i'm gonna go to other third bro sounds by hippie and i am going to head up to um leave files empty um i'm gonna just take this copy this all the way over and replace next we are going to go and change a wastegate um 
Let's do the dump valve first. I'll make the dump valve silent. I don't really like to hear a dump valve and I'll just let you listen to some of them, how they sound. It's, it's okay. You can just choose whichever one you want. I usually don't have, um, actually let's put in a dump valve. Why not? Right. Let's put it in one. I don't use turbo on my police cars, so it's fine. All right, now let's go to, I like the old wastegate, the old virgins, um, a lot more than the new ones. So we're just going to listen to a few and see which ones we like. And uh, I'll just use that one. Fuck it. All right, we're going to just choose that and then press OK. Replace whatever is in there. You're going to head back out. And there are some original files there if you messed up something. But we're done with Turbo Songs by Hippie. Next, we're going to go to the Ford indicator sound. We're going to go in, press audio, take all of these, copy this over into the other file. And that is literally it. We're going to go back out again. We're going to go to the Dodge chime. We're going to take this, open this, and then carry this over, replace. And there it is. Next now. We are going to put this file back into our GTA and that's done by going back to open IV. You're going to press vehicles.awc correction. You're going to press click on that. Make sure it's highlighted. Then we're going to go up to new and then press op, um, input import open formats. We're going to find the dot um, OAC file and then press open and then press OK and it should bring everything back in next we are going to go over to um back to x64 audio sound effects and then we're gonna put in our um sounds our, our gun sounds um for this one this one has a 5m package so let me let me just copy this over here it has a 5m compatibility so we're gonna just take this and put this right over here and that should be it for our sounds for all of these things to work we need to start archive fixing everything so go ahead and head over to your gta 5 directory and you're gonna go x64 audio sound effects and now we're gonna got we have to to start um taking over all of these things so we can go to weapons player and archive fix all of these files just to make sure that they all work and i think that should be it so just the two of those weapons player and the resident or rpf make sure that it all works and then we should be good to head into server so i'll bring you guys back once i've finished that all right y'all i had to kind of double back on what i was saying because um, the the siren and the gun sounds with 5M compatibility will clash. So what I'll do is that I'm going to take this over here and I'm going to drag it into here. And we're going to install this directly into our game folder. I have an extra 5M copy. Sorry, not 5M, GTA 5 copy. So in case this breaks, I can easily just um, replace everything. So now because we just changed that, I need to archive fix all the files that I just changed. So uh, first one, weapons player, archive fix that. And then we are going to do resident.rpf. Then we're going to go back out here, go back to uh, update and then exit for DLC packs. And then we're going to um, archive fix these DLCs because that file will change all of these DLC packs or the LC files so that we can have both the um, the gun sounds and the siren in and this should work I've done this a lot I used to use the 4.0 version of this uh, gun sounds mod but I had to switch to the uh, that one the I had a switch I wanted a switch I want to get a new one so might as well just do it right so I'll bring you guys back once I have got in game loaded in and make sure everything is working. All right, y'all welcome back. Um, so we're going to just check out a couple of the sounds here. First thing, hopefully. Yep. That's the dodge door thing, even though that's a Ford. Let me, let me stop disrespecting the mobile guys like that. And let's get 
Let's get a charger out. And that's the, the dodge door chime. I, I like it. It's pretty good. And then we got the Ford indicator sound. So you can hear it from my hazards how, the, how everything sounds like that. Next, we're going to check the gun sounds. I like these gun sounds a lot. So that's why I like, you know, this one. So it just sounds so good. Um, let's just try out different weapons, right? I could still got a little assets to load because I'm just just back, you know, so. Every gun has pretty much slightly different sound. Oh, let's, let's not use that. Nope, not that. And it sounds sounds really good, yo. Sounds really that sounds good. Can't use that. Clear. Maybe. Yep, that that. Those sound pretty good, I'm not gonna lie. Yep. Alright, let's just check the siren though. Alright, so now I'm kind of tasked with finding a car so that you guys can have a listen to the, um, what do you call it? The, the engine sounds, I guess you could say. So let's, let's, let's see if I can find a, a car that, that will work with. Um, not sure which ones. Maybe the, yes, no, let's go to sports classics. I'm pretty sure that this one, it does it with this one. So let's just get that out, right? Oh, they mean to spawn too. All right, let's just put some on it real quick. Um, all right, engine all the way up. Let's do some turbo. All right, nah, it's not. It's not giving me the sound. I don't. I don't remember which cars it does it with, but it's supposed to give me a sound. Maybe. Maybe we just uh, let's just check a Elio car, and let's just put turbo on it. I don't use turbo with my Elio cars, so you guys will never hear it when I'm driving as Elio. But some cars. In um, some civilian cars, you may see me with that one. There it is. That's the sound. Yeah, that's that's how it sounds with the turbo on. So, you guys can obviously pick and choose which ones you want and which ones you're going to use. But those are just mine. So... All right, y'all. So that's going to be it for this tutorial. Thank you guys for joining me. Thank you for being here. I really appreciate each and every one of you. I hope this makes your game sound really, really well. I need a real cleanup. I need to go to the barber. But yeah, um, without further, well, that's going to be it for today's video. Let me know what you want to see next. If you want to see my videos and stuff, go ahead and drop a like, comment, subscribe, turn on notifications so you know if I post. Drop a comment. Let me know if you're able, you want to see my videos and uh, we'll, I'll definitely do a video on it. But I'm going to be out here now, going to go and edit this and then head to work. So see you guys next time. Have a great day. Have a great peace. Remember to go after all your goals and your dreams. You can do it. You can do it. You can do it. Anyways, I'll see you guys later, guys.